instead of doing this, 6 times 8, 48. 6 times 2, 12, plus 4, 16, which is equal to 168. Meron tayong another tricks in getting the product of 6. So, ano nga ba yung tricks natin dito? 28 times 6. The first step, i-divide lang natin ng 2 yung number na minumultiply natin ng 6. So, 28 divided by 2, which is equal to 14. Okay? Next step, i-multiply natin ng 10. So, 14 times 10. 14 times 10 is equal to 140. Para naglagay lang tayo ng 0 after ng 4. Okay? That is the second step. Next step, mag-add lang tayo ng 28 sa 140 natin. So, 28 plus 28. So, 8, 6, then 1. 168. Same answer, right? At kaya isolve mentally. Okay? And now, let's have some exercises. In number 2, 64 times 6. The first step, i-divide lang natin ng 2 yung number na minumultiply natin ng 6. So, 64 divided by 2, we have 32. Okay? Next step, Yung 32, i-multiply natin ng 10. So, 32 times 10, we have 320. The last step, i-add natin yung 320 sa 64. So, 64 plus 320, we have 384. Did you get it? Okay, number 3. 142 times 6. The first step, divide natin ng 2. So, 142 divided by 2 is equal to 71. Okay? 71. And then, i-multiply natin ng 10. So, 710. Next, i-add lang natin 142 plus 700. 10, we have 852. So, 142 times 6 is 852. Okay? Now, it's your turn. Number 4. 260 times 6. Comment down your answer for me to check if you really understand our lesson for this video. Don't forget to like. Subscribe to my YouTube channel and click the notification bell for more updates. See you next time!